today we will see how to do hypothesis test using jet value in excel in three minutes so here we have hypothesis value and uh, alpha and uh, we have roll number of one to ten and obtain mark of them so at first we will <coughs> calculate this sample size and to calculate sample size the uh, rule is equal to count and then drag uh, the roll number column of students and it is down and average market uh, average mark for them we will calculate by using the rules of average and drag the obtain mark of the students uh, so the next is population standard deviation so calculate this uh, we will uh, need <coughs> the rules of uh, stdfp and we uh, drag the obtain mark column and it is down so next is jet calculated value and it is a uh, uh most critical things of our item so we will first uh, do bracket first bracket then select average mark column and then minus uh, the our hypothesis value so bracket close and it's it will be divided by uh, first bracket uh, population standard deviation divided by square root so for square root we will use the sqrt so square root then first bracket and choose the sample size value and so we will bracket close here and enter so this is our jet calculated value and for calculate the p value just uh, write jet test and uh, drag the all number of obtain mark and uh, press comma and put your hypothesis value and press enter so this is a p value uh, so next is decision so decision for making we will use the rules of if so if first bracket P value uh, is greater than alpha so the true statement will be do not reject bracket close and the false will be reject so now when you hit enter it will show the reject because uh, here the p value is less than the alpha